One of the most challenging vocal skills is the ability to take chest voice high and make it look easy. Here are some tips on how to make a belting sound while protecting your vocal folds from harm. Start with tall posture, making sure that your chest is comfortably high and that the back of your neck is long. Now chest voice is simply taking your talking sound up high. I'm talking, I'm talking, I'm talking. It doesn't have to be super loud and heavy, though it, it could be, and you don't have to feel vibration in your chest. Let's start with Belcher's bite. Take your little fingers and bite gently on them with your back molars. Notice how your chewing muscle is now engaged on either side of your face. Make sure that your jaw is firm but still flexible by doing this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Notice how your chin is protruding a bit forward? That's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. And remember to push your chin down gently for each high note. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you'll need extra abdominal support for high chest voice. So make sure that you firm out in this area of your upper belly, just below your, your sternum. Hold back on your breath a little too when you make these sounds. Now try that sound on high notes, making sure you're not in head voice. If you think you may be in head voice, the fluty sound, like this, beep, 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 begin lower in your range, and you can pull gently forward on the upper neck with your hands. That'll help keep you in chest voice. I call this laryngeal lean. Now try some calls like, how you doing? How you doing? Come over here! Go over there! Just like you're calling across the street. Now use these tips whenever you want to take chest voice high. Remember that the goals are comfort, consistency, and of course, be absolutely thrilling.